Hey guys, this is Evie and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how I did these red ombre nails with pixie crystals. So for this look, I did use tips and I'm applying them using this IBD brush on nail glue. I believe I got these tips from banggood.com. I will leave a link down below, but they are natural colored and um, after I got them all on, I am just using a sharp small pair of scissors to cut off the corners to help me shape them into a coffin shape. And I'm just taking my hand file just to smooth out the sides. So for this design, I'm using Long Hair Pretty Nails Clear in Pink Nude Acrylic, Nail Nails Glaze Cherries Acrylic, and this is a beautiful bright red color with iridescent fine glitter in it. So I've already prepped and primed and I'm applying a thin layer of clear acrylic to my nail bed. And then I'm going in with that glazed cherry acrylic and I'm applying that to the center of the nail and working it down the tip. And because this color is so pigmented and intense, I went ahead and applied it to all of the nails first um, because my monomer was getting tinted. So I just wanted to apply this to all the nails first and then I switched out my monomer after I applied this color. All right, so once I have all of the glazed cherry acrylic applied, I'm going in with the Long Hair Pretty Nails Pink Nude Acrylic and I'm applying that at the cuticle area and working it down the nail and bringing that over the glazed cherry acrylic just to create a nice ombre.
all right so once i've applied all of the pink nude acrylic i'm just gonna go in with the long care pretty nails clear acrylic and apply that over the transition area between the glazed cherry and the pink nude just to keep that intact so i can file the nails without disturbing that ombre and this is just a very thin layer of clear All right, so this is after all of the acrylic is applied and dry. And now I'm going in with my nail file and doing my shaping and filing. And this is after the nails have been filed, shaped, and buffed. And now I'm going in with a combination of the Poochie Snails Bling Gel and the Poochie Snails Super Shine Gel Top Coat. I have noticed that the Poochie Snails Bling Gel is discontinued, but it is just a builder gel. So you can use your favorite builder gel and top coat and this technique should work out for you. So I just go ahead and apply the Bling Gel first to my pinky fingernail and my middle fingernail. And without caring, I apply the Poochie's Nails top coat over it. And then I'm going in with these Pixie Crystals that I got from Born Pretty Store. I will leave a link to these down below. But I just go ahead and sprinkle these onto the uncured gel and just making sure they're all in place and lightly tap them into place and all that good stuff. And then I went ahead and cured that. And then for the middle finger, I applied Swarovski crystals and iridescent crystals. The iridescent crystals are available on my website. I will leave the link down below. But once I have all those crystals in place, I go ahead and cure in my LED lamp. And then I apply the Poochie Snails Super Shine Gel Top Coat to all of the other nails. And cure that in my LED lamp for 60 seconds. And then I apply my cuticle oil. And this is the finished look just a nice and simple pink nude to red ombre i love how these nails turned out and i just love the pixie crystal nail it gives the perfect accent so i hope you guys enjoyed this nail tutorial head over to longcareprettynails.com and check out my shop thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will talk to you in my next one